I'm down at the local IRS office, and I want to ask you a question. If there was money here on the sidewalk and you were walking by, let's say a $100 bill, would you pick it up? I think you would. Well, the largest loss area in people's budget today is taxes. I mean, hundreds, if not thousands of dollars a month, people losing taxes. You say, well, why don't they just pick the money up? Why do they lose it? Because they don't know it's there because they don't understand taxes. Well, today on Fixing the Money Thing, I'm gonna expose and show you money that's sitting on the sidewalk that you need to pick up in the area of taxes. We're gonna show you how to locate and identify the money that you're giving away that you never thought in taxes. Today on Fixing the Money Thing. With most families burdened in unsustainable levels of personal debt, most Americans believe there is no way to have financial freedom. However, author, pastor, and financial expert Gary Cassie believes most families can be completely out of debt in less than seven years. You must get out of debt. You've got to make right choices with your money right now. Gary and his wife Drenda are now on a crusade to share this information that changed their life so that you can not just survive, but prosper in today's economy. Your life can be totally transformed by an idea in the marketplace. This is Gary Cassie, Fixing the Money Thing. Welcome to Fixing the Money Thing. I'm Gary Cassie. And I'm Drenda Cassie. You know, most people think it's impossible to get out of debt because they just don't have any extra money. But today on Fixing the Money Thing, Gary's going to show you that the average family has thousands of dollars they never knew they had in a place they never thought to look. Again, we're not talking about a $20 bill here. We're talking thousands. And that's why Gary calls this the mother load of free cash. It's in a place you never thought. It is in a favorite topic of all of us, taxes. Mm. So stay tuned to Fixing the Money Thing. We're gonna talk about how to find the mother load, the missing cash, the overpayments you're making in taxes in just a minute. Here are a few things you may not know about taxation in America. In 2011, the IRS collected over $2.4 trillion from over 234 million tax returns. The number of people needed to prepare income taxes every year in the U.S. is larger than the number of people in the Iraqi army. Our income tax system is actually voluntary. The IRS only exists to, quote, maximize voluntary tax law compliance by emphasizing customer satisfaction. The Bible has about 700,000 words. The current federal tax code is over 3.7 million words. Americans spend over $27.7 billion every year just getting their taxes prepared. Albert Einstein was quoted saying, the hardest thing in the world to understand is the income tax. Well, taxes, it's a huge topic, but I want to make a point very clear at first, and that is, in no way am I saying we're not paying taxes, Dorinda. I mean, I make sure people know that. When I say I'm going to talk about how to not, you know, lose money in taxes, I am not stating that we do not pay taxes. Right. So I'll make sure we have that right. going in. But, it, you know, most people think taxes are boring. I, I mean, when you say taxes, I kind of go, oh. <laughs> but how big of an area of loss is it that people are incurring because of taxes? Let me say this. Most people would agree that it's boring. But when we talk about taxes today, it'll probably be the most exciting thing they have talked about or heard about today. Why? <laughs> because there's free cash. It's their cash, but okay. it's just money that's sitting there they've overpaid right. without knowing it. And taxes are getting more and more all the time. Yeah, let me, let me get an example. Tax Freedom Day. Write this date down in your calendar, April 18th. Until April 18th, every day you work from morning till night, all of the money goes to pay taxes. It takes that long, Drenda, every year just to get the taxes paid. So it's no wonder people are having trouble paying their bills, right? Right. Listen to this numbers. Last year, Americans paid $2.76 trillion in federal taxes, $1.45 trillion in state taxes. That's 29.4% of the percentage of the average income goes to pay taxes, not counting local taxes, not counting sales taxes, gasoline taxes, property taxes. The average family pays about 40% of their entire earnings wow. in taxes. Okay, so what can we do about it? If we're paying this, this amount of taxes, is there anything you can do? Now just think for a moment. 
this area of taxes, if it's 40% of our income, there's got to be a lot of movement there. There's got to be a lot of cash floating around. Most people think that it's stagnant, that basically it's pretty firm, that the laws are clear, everyone pays the same amount. You know, it's, it, it's not how it works. So I want to jump into some ideas. I want to help people today, Drinda, understand taxes. First, we do pay taxes. I'd like you to read a scripture out of Matthew chapter 22, verse 17 for me and read that. Uh, Jesus sets the posture on taxes here. All right, it says, tell us then, what is your opinion? Is it right to pay taxes to Caesar or not? But Jesus, knowing their evil intent, said, you hypocrites, why are you trying to trap me? Show me the coin used for paying this tax. They brought him a denarius and he said to them, whose portion or whose portrait, I'm sorry, is this and whose inscription? Caesar's, they replied. Then he said to them, give to Caesar what is Caesar's and give to God what is God's. Right. So again, we are saying that we, we owe taxes, we pay taxes. That's, that's clear. But how much do we owe? That's the question. And what does Caesar say we owe? What does the law say? That can be difficult because the law is so huge. Millions of words, a huge number of pages. But to give you an idea, Drenda, let's take a look back at a Money Magazine study. This is fascinating. Let's put this on the screen. I want to show our viewers this. What we have here is a eight-year study that Money Magazine did with the same criteria, the same data. In other words, took a family's, you know, yearly data and took it to a tax preparer to have it done. They took it to 50 different tax preparers, okay, the same data. And amazingly, throughout the entire eight-year study, not one tax preparer matched another with the taxes owed. Wow. Now, let's look at this difference here. For instance, this year, $6,807 was owed. Another accountant, you know, other people had it up to 73000 Which accountant would you want? The 6000 <laughs> <laughs> Well, what's, what's the law say? I mean, that is huge. So obviously, there's... All these numbers don't match. There's thousands of dollars difference in what 50 accountants say someone owes. So it must be, and these are professional preparers, not your little computer, you know, preparer software. These are computer, I mean, these are CPAs and professionals. So what's the chances of you getting it right, Drenda? Wow. How, Money can, it be, how can it be said, so different? <laughs> well, it's, the, the code is so difficult. It is so huge that no one, even the IRS, notes that 50% of their informational phone calls to people's questions are wrong. Wow. That's the IRS's own study they did on themselves. Now, they went on again. Money Magazine went on again and did another study where they asked 50 tax repairs 10 questions about taxes. Not one preparer got all 10 questions right. Only 34 got half right. Money Magazine's conclusion is they guarantee that the average American is losing, or I should say overpaying, at least 25% more in taxes than they need to. Wow, and what can we do about this? Well, <laughs> how, can we, how can we fix this area? All right, so here's one thing we suggest here on Fixing the Money thing. You probably travel across town to, uh, I know we do, if a sale's taking place, we'll travel across town to save a few dollars. Let me ask you, based on that chart, would it be worth driving across town for a second opinion Absolutely. on your tax return? <laughs> yes. One thing you wanna do, especially if you have a business, more complicated type returns, you want to get a second opinion. That'll save you or could save you thousands of dollars. Now, a lot of people are afraid to refile a return if they find they made a mistake. But the 1040X form, you can go back and fix the return. You have three years if you want to change a return that's been filed. And uh, you need to take advantage of that if you find other data that supports something you can deduct that you didn't do. But this form is especially interesting. The penalty. How many people are afraid of IRS penalties? Yeah. Everyone I think it's says, why people don't even get involved with it. They're afraid of it. Every, you'll hear this phrase a lot. You know, people owe back taxes say, well, I could pay the tax. It's just the penalties are mm -hmm. killing me, you know. Well, there's a form, 843, right here that people don't know exist that you can actually ask for an abatement. That means forgiveness of penalties. Now, you simply have to have a legitimate reason while you're, while you're late 
or you couldn't pay your taxes when they were due. And essentially, you're going to tell the IRS you weren't trying to steal from the IRS. You just had a legitimate reason why you couldn't pay it at that time or, you know, you were late paying it. And once the tax is paid for that year that you're paying on, that you've had penalties assessed on, then you have two years to file this form, 843, and ask for the penalties back. So once you've paid it, you can still get your penalty money back within yes. two year period of time. In fact, you have to pay the taxes first okay. and the penalties and ask for it back. And then they'll, they'll send it back to you. Now, I know this works because you and I have done this way back in history. We, mm -hmm. we found this out and did this and got the check. So 843 is the form. And again, as we go through this, the show today, we're just going to mention things. You need to write these things down because we're talking about finding your money. There is a huge variance in how taxes are figured. That's right. We want to challenge you to take control of your life and be financially free. Check out today's resources and we'll be back with some solutions every taxpayer is going to want to hear. We're finding the mother load of lost money now on Fixing the Money Thing. Share your success story of debt elimination. Get your financially free kid to get started. Share your story and we'll bless someone with $3,000 to continue paying off debt and enjoying financial freedom. Visit financiallyfreechallenge.com, leave your email address and share your success story with us. Today's resources from Fixing the Money Thing are designed to start a financial revolution in your life, get you living the life God destined for you, and of course, fix your money thing. Are you living your dream? Is debt causing you to trade your joy for paying the creditors? Then it's time to be financially free. Are you in debt or living paycheck to paycheck? Then I would suggest you may need a financial revolution. New from Fixing the Money Thing, the Financially Free Kit delivers the tools you need to be free from debt forever. The kit starts with the all-new Financially Free Workbook, a practical how-to guide filled with step-by-step -step instructions for collecting the data you need for your free get-out-of-debt plan, forms, and worksheets. The kit also includes a DVD from Gary, walking you through the workbook steps to financial freedom. This workbook will take you step-by-step -step through the process to get your family free. Next, you get the Financial Foundations Toolkit, six CDs of powerful information to keep you tracking toward financial freedom. CDs include Revolution of the Mind Messages on Fear, Money Proverbs and Finances, Gary's Foundational Message, Heaven Here and Now, How to Protect Your Investments in Retirement, and Gary's It's My Business CD. Call, write, or go to GaryCasey.com. And for only $75, get the new Financially Free Kit that also includes a set of financial scripture cards, handy reminders of God's promises for your finances, and a calculator from fixing the money thing to track your progress. Until you stop the debt trap and stop living according to the world system, you're not going to be free. Call 888-391-LIFE. That's 888-391-5433. Visit GaryCasey.com or write to Faith Life Now. P.O. Box 779, New Albany, Ohio, 43054 to order the Financially Free Kit, Workbook, Instructional DVD, 6 CD Series, Financial Scripture Cards, and Calculator for your $75 or more gift in support of Faith Life Ministries. For only $99 or more, we'll include the book that started it all, Fixing the Money Thing by Gary Cassie. Get started understanding kingdom principles. Read Fixing the Money Thing. Share your email address and you'll start receiving weekly encouragement emails from Gary throughout your journey to financial freedom. Gary Cassie wants to revolutionize your finances and teach you the kingdom principles you need to fix your money thing. And for anyone needing more tax help, look for tax expert Dan Pilla's resources at GaryCassie.com as well. Take the challenge, call, write, or log on now to get your financially free resources to help you destroy debt and start living free. Wow, we find out people are really afraid to mess yep. with the IRS. I know we were talking during the break, yeah. asking them would they refile our for- Our staff, you mean. Yeah, our yeah. staff, you know, $100, $500. Right. And most of them said no, you know, it's because like, it's complicated. <laughs> it's complicated, but also uh, you're afraid a little bit. I think there's a fear factor. Oh, that I, absolutely. Have. That's what the penalties, that's what it's all designed to do. We don't have to be afraid. 
Now, we don't have to be afraid because it's a legal issue. Feelings don't, they're not involved. It's all a legal issue. And of course, as you saw, the accountants didn't get it right. So what's your chances about zip? I'm just kidding. No, we're just talking about finding money. You don't have to know all the stuff accountants have to know. But you do need to know some of the basics on how to protect yourself by doing your homework and doing proper documentation and how to find cash. So let's go further and talk about finding money. That's more exciting than yes. paying taxes, yes. okay? All right. All right, so let's talk about finding money. First off, most people are excited about a tax refund check. Every year in America, about two thirds of the population get a refund check because they're afraid of the IRS, right? They'd rather have it withheld to make sure they don't have to pay anything. And they get a check back every year over $2,000 on the average with how much interest does the Zero. IRS pay? Zero but they celebrate interest. it when they get that check back. Yeah, oh yeah, that's their whatever party money to go out and do buy something money. But the bottom line is, let's say it's two thousand dollars. That's one hundred sixty-six dollars a month. If you took the one sixty-six a month and you paid off an eighteen percent credit card with that one sixty-six, mm. that is the same exactly as investing at eighteen percent. Wow, that's good. Say that again. That I'm is just good. Saying, whatever you pay off, whatever debt you pay off, whatever interest rate it is. It's the same as investing at that interest rate because you've just stopped the decline or the loss at that rate. So that makes a lot more sense than giving the IRS free loans. All that's right. Same Write money you down. gave them each month that you shouldn't have. You yes. could have been paying off an 18% loan and getting out of debt and you would have exactly. saved yourself and made 18% interest. Right. We don't have time to go through all the details, but check with your employer and pick up a W-4 form. It actually has a worksheet with it that'll help you refile for your tax refund properly with your employer's withholding tax system. Okay, here's number two. Get your pencil ready. Just going through a couple quick items. If I gave you an $80 check, would you take it or tear it up is the question. I take it. Okay, well, most people tear it up because you can write off nonprofit mileage. If you go to church and you work in the nursery, you can write the mileage off. Did you know that? People wow. don't write mileage off going to church, but if you did that, just 20 miles a week, let's say, or so, after you get through the year, 80 bucks is 80 bucks, right? Sure. I mean, it all adds up, fragments are fragments. Sure. And so just by looking for fragments and ways to save money in the tax code, it's simple to find money. The biggest, the big one, okay, how to save money in the tax code, the big way to do that is to have a business. Write that down, mm -hmm. you need a business. Businesses can write so many things off that normal people that just have a salaried position can't. So even if you have a salaried position, you have a business on the side, yes. you're going to save a lot in taxes. You need a business, a home-based business. And there's so many reasons. Let me just go through it really quick. But first off, you can write off floor space at your house and have a home office deduction. The rule is that space has to be used regularly and exclusively for your business. But let's say you do that, then whatever percentage of your house that space is, you can take the same percentage off your utility bills, lawn care, everything that is required to run your house, you now can deduct against your business income. That's powerful. How about free income? I know a lot of you might give your kids allowances. Let's not do that anymore. Let's pay them. If you have a business at home, you can pay your kids. Now here's the key. If they're under 21, you don't have to withhold Social Security and unemployment taxes. So it becomes tax-free money. Well, also, if they make less than 10000 a year, you don't have to file a return. So basically, it's $10,000 free money as long as they're doing legitimate work like stuffing envelopes, taking the trash out, whatever is required to run your business. Can instead they include of, keeping the room clean? <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know about that. But the bottom line is if they, instead of just giving them an allowance, let's write that money off. It's free income. Uh, to, to the household because you're going to spend it either way. You're going to buy Johnny's right. whatever or do this for Johnny or whatever. So anyway, that's a great way. And you're mentoring them. And you're mentoring them in business. Also, a business person has the ability to write health insurance off. And that's a big deal. You hire your spouse into your business, you can write off their health insurance. And if it's a spouse having health insurance, they can cover the whole family, which includes you, the owner of the company. And there is nothing shady about this is perfectly oh, no, this legal. this is all legal. Yes, all this is, legal. This is how, how about vacations? You know, you can write some vacations off by a little planning, go on a business trip and make it a vacation and write the, the vacation off. Also, there's so many other ways to save money in business, but for one way, an S corporation, which you may not know what that is, it's just one of the structures 
we'll talk about in a minute, but in an S corporation, if you own your company, you can take part of your income in dividends instead of salary, and you receive dividends, you don't have to pay Social Security and unemployment tax on that. That saves you quite a bit of money as well. So I know these things are going fast. Also retirement, a typical person that has a salary may or may not be able to have an IRA, depending if their employer has a retirement program or not. But the bottom line, if they do qualify, the person that has a salary, if they do qualify to have an IRA, they're limited to $5,000 a year unless they're over 50, and then it's 6,000. But if you own a business, you can invest so much more of your money into retirement accounts. Uh, the, the limits are so much bigger in those company or business retirement accounts that you might want to take advantage of. So let's right. talk about one thing. I know I'm talking fast, time's limited here. Just write these things down. Structure, you have a business, the structure is critical. How you structure it. We get emails all the time, Drenda, about what structure should I structure my business? Here's the options, sole proprietorship, that's just me doing business as, or a partnership, or a corporation, like you know, you know what corporations are, or an S corporation, that's a small business corporation, or an LLC, you'll hear that quite a bit these days, a limited liability company. Those are the structures you have to pick from and they all have different tax ramifications on how they work. Now to help you find the best solution for your business, we're offering free, at Fixing the Money Thing, two reports by Dan Pilla, who, by the way, the Associated Press says knows more about the tax code than the IRS itself. If you go to our website at GaryCassie.com, you'll get, number one, Dan Pill's Guide to Starting Your Own Business. It's a detailed report on how to choose the structure of your business, as well as the 14 top mistakes business owners make that cost them thousands. Mm. By doing it right, could save them thousands. And then also, the five things to do before April 15th that you need to take advantage of to make sure you're getting all the tax deductions that are out there. And Drenda, this is a huge topic. Wow, but that's a lot of great information in a very short time. Yeah, it's just, you know, there's so much. I just wanted to cover a couple things to catch your attention that there's lots and lots of money there. Yes. For just a little bit of time it takes to research some of these options and we can help you with those, but there's money there, big That's money right. there. That's right. You know, there's only so much we can do to help you in the short time we have each day here on Fixing the Money Thing. That's why we make these resources available to you. And I strongly encourage you, take advantage of what Gary's put together on today's offer. Get financially free. Take our challenge. Take a look at it. Today's resources from Fixing the Money Thing are designed to start a financial revolution in your life, get you living the life God destined for you, and of course, fix your money thing. Are you living your dream? Is debt causing you to trade your joy for paying the creditors? Then it's time to be financially free. Are you in debt or living paycheck to paycheck? Then I would suggest you may need a financial revolution. New from Fixing the Money Thing, the Financially Free Kit delivers the tools you need to be free from debt forever. The kit starts with the all new Financially Free Workbook, a practical how-to guide filled with step-by-step -step instructions for collecting the data you need for your free get out of debt plan, forms and worksheets. The kit also includes a DVD from Gary, walking you through the workbook steps to financial freedom. This workbook will take you step by step through the process to get your family free. Next, you get the Financial Foundations Toolkit, six CDs of powerful information to keep you tracking toward financial freedom. CDs include Revolution of the Mind Messages on Fear, Money Proverbs and Finances, Gary's Foundational Message, Heaven Here and Now, how to protect your investments in retirement, and Gary's It's My Business CD. Call, write, or go to GaryCasee.com, and for only $75, get the new Financially Free Kit that also includes a set of financial scripture cards, handy reminders of God's promises for your finances, and a calculator from fixing the money thing to track your progress. Until you stop the debt trap and stop living according to the world system, you're not gonna be free. Call 888-391-LIFE. That's 888-391-5433. Visit GaryCasee.com or write to Faith Life Now, P.O. Box 779, New Albany, Ohio, 
1-800-458-43054 to order the Financially Free Kit, Workbook, Instructional DVD, 6 CD Series, Financial Scripture Cards, and Calculator for your $75 or more gift in support of Faith Life Ministries. For only $99 or more, we'll include the book that started it all, Fixing the Money Thing by Gary Cassie. Get started understanding kingdom principles. Read Fixing the Money Thing. Share your email address and you'll start receiving weekly encouragement emails from Gary throughout your journey to financial freedom. Gary Cassie wants to revolutionize your finances and teach you the kingdom principles you need to fix your money thing. And for anyone needing more tax help, look for tax expert Dan Pilla's resources at GaryCassie.com as well. Take the challenge, call, write, or log on now to get your financially free resources to help you destroy debt and start living free. I know that taxes may sound overwhelming and may be kind of confusing, but I wanted to make sure you understand there is real money there, a lot of money that can be repositioned to get you out of debt. And to help you do that, we have additional resources at our website at GaryCC.com on taxes, Please take the time to look through that material and maybe you'll find some more material on taxes that will help you get out of debt even faster. That's right. You know, we remember what it was like to be in debt. We want to hear your story. Give us your story about why you want to get out of debt. We're going to pick the best story of why you want to get out of debt and we're going to award that person $3,000 toward their debt. That's right, $3,000 of your debt we're going to pay off because we know what it's like to be in debt. We want to see you financially free. That's right. We want to thank you for joining us today on Fixing the Money Thing and want to encourage you to consider becoming a Team Revolution partner. Go to our website, GarrickC.com, check it out, and let's get excited about finding money in the tax area. That's right. Thank you for joining us today on Fixing the Money Thing. Fixing the Money Thing is graciously brought to you by the Forward Financial Group and Lindsay, Honda, and Acura. Share your success story of debt elimination. Get your financially free kit to get started. Share your story and we'll bless someone with $3,000 to continue paying off debt and enjoying financial freedom. Visit financiallyfreechallenge.com, leave your email address, and share your success story with us. When you need God's help, Prayer is always the answer. Pastor Gary understands and wants to help. That's why he has caring friends standing by 24 hours a day, seven days a week, ready to pray with you. Call and let's agree together. You can watch Gary Cassie's services live from Faith Life Church. Service times are Saturdays at 6 p.m. Eastern and Sunday mornings at 9.30 and 11.30 Eastern. Enjoy the life-changing teachings of Gary Cassie every weekend. Come experience Faith Life Church for yourself and become part of a close-knit gathering of people who want something more. Located on the east side of Columbus, just 10 minutes from Easton off of 161. Come home and experience new life at Faith Life Church. Join Gary and Drenda Cassie in Raleigh, North Carolina, May 16th, 17th, and 18th at Celebration Church, 8700 Capitol Boulevard. For directions or more information, go to GaryCassie.com. Fixing the Money Thing is a presentation of Faith Life Now.